Hey, -o. Saki Knight here, and welcome to A Glider's Journey. Oh, oh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Okay, mouse control, mouse control. Alright, this is very soothing, if nothing else. Except for the immediate panic that you get when the game launches. Oh no, 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 I missed it! Oh, shame. And that's where he died. Oh, oh, we're just going straight through. Okay, just immediately back in. That's kind of nice. I have a feeling that this is going to take me a handful of tries. Because I am not a very steady handed person. Ah! As I said. Not very steady handed. No, no, no. I gotta turn. I gotta find the end. Uh... Rip. Is that really all there is to this? Just uh, gliding around. Can I play this with the controller, I wonder? Because that would make this somewhat easier. just there we go yeah okay, both sticks control it that's a little that's something a little less finicky because it's not my hand controlling it. I mean, I guess it is, but not as directly. You went too high. You flew too high, Icarus. The sun! The sun, Icarus! The sun! <laughs> Um, alright. Why am I bad at flying a paper plane? Very, very, very pretty. Very, very calm world. I would also be calm in this world if it were not for the fact that I was having to fly this annoying ass goddamn plane. If I had infinite fuel, I could just go over. Look at that. Look at that nice little cabin. I don't know what's going on with that. Skim past the water. No, no, no. There we go. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. It's gotta not do not fuck it up. Just stay nice and calm. If you're not calm, why aren't you calm? Why aren't you calm? Oh, 
is that where I'm heading? Is that is that red dot where I'm trying to land? Uh, don't don't make it a landing challenge. That's annoying. Fucking hell. <coughs> okay. Is that level level one? That yeah, that's level one. Okay. Well then. Now we're on to some sort of crazy ring world. I'll be honest, I wasn't I wasn't expecting this to be a puzzle game, because that's what it kinda seems like. Basically a puzzle game. Ugh. Yeah, I was not was not expecting let's just let's just skip past this for now. Let's just see what the hard part of the level is, right? The hard part. That's why I can't do it, because the future is the hard part. That's going to be my excuse. a loop to loop to a paper flame challenge whoever does this is a criminal but I think I have to catch them all to yeah gotta get the all the rings otherwise it doesn't count shame <laughs> I got an achievement for <laughs> hmm Got an achievement for that. But they knew that I was snarky. Didn't follow the path they wanted. Yeah, I don't know. When I when I went to launch this game, I kind of I don't know if you know it, but I kind of uh thought it was gonna be like an upgrade kind of game, like like, um, Learn to Fly, the little, I think that's what it was called, a little flash game with a penguin that you were, was trying to learn how to fly. And you had to slide down a ramp and then jump off the end and eventually break through a giant glacier at the end of the map. I think that was the third one. And every time you, um, Every time you jumped, you would gain money based on how far you went, and the speed and stuff. So it was going to be that kind of game. I'm not disappointed with this, but I probably would have enjoyed that style of game a little more, even though it's a bit grindier at the start. It's just jumping off to get a small amount of progress. Shame. Alright. I think I'm gonna have to pull another fishy situation. Because I don't think there's really more that this game will offer beyond other levels. Which, not, not a bad thing, but it's not really something that makes it easy for me to comment on. At a certain point, I'll just start getting drawn into it and blindly playing without saying anything. Alright. So I'm gonna go grab what looks like another short game, and I'll be back! Woo! Hello. And welcome to Hello Pollution.
I think it speaks for itself. It's a game about pollution. I guess. Jacob Mudstone. Hello. I have some junk I would like you to dispose for me. Thank you. Alright. It's not a great message, I'll be honest, but... Uh, but it is what it is. Get that rat down in there, yeah. Yeah. Not a not a great message, but here we are. I don't know if they want the rats in the uh landfill or not. But that's where they're going. Ooh. Or are they try to help me put things in the landfill. I don't I don't know. It's not a Hi, I represent a large nuclear facility nearby. We need to get rid of nuclear waste. Make sure you don't break these barrels or you'll ruin the environment and attract unwanted attention to our operations. Yay. Excellent. More nuclear waste. Melting. Oh no. Not more nuclear waste. <laughs> that poor bunny. Look how sick it is. Shame. Polluting the environment. That's a crime. <laughs> oh, only $4,000 a pine? How easy. Boy, this game's kind of kind of horrible, huh? Not in the not necessarily in the gameplay sense, but more just This game's kind of horrible, huh? Destroying the world one box at a time. But at least the bunny's happy now. Can I set this on fire? I can. I can just burn the boxes. Of course. What a fool I was. Weed forth. Oh no. It's gonna be a bunch of weeb shit. Trash burn. Flower burn. Oh, I can't burn the pot. Yeah, makes sense. Trash burn, though. Ah. Uh, yikes. After her husband died. Quote, unquote. What we're going to call it. <clears throat> oh, that doesn't sound like my problem. They're trying to fucking hey, hey, hey. That's my fucking trash. <laughs> A burning tire. That'll stay burning forever. One more flower pot to the mix. But we'll burn the last one. I think, yeah, I think you're kind of supposed to burn everything a little. That seems 
because I don't know if I would have fit all of, of those trash bags in here. All right, landfill, landfill filled. Gene Research Lab. Hi, Gary. A contaminated materials, very dangerous bat girls filled with poisonous chlorine gas. Okay, burn everything except the barrels. You got it, Barry. You got it. Don't burn the poisonous gas barrels. But burn the research notes. What happens if I don't burn all the notes? <laughs> What happens if I didn't burn anything? Pet food factory. Hi, mister. My good lazy dog food. I feel like Kelly, let's just say that this food is something perhaps too human. Oh, yikes. <clears throat> yikes. Something tells me I don't want it to be seen by that. Something a bit too human in the dog food. What does that even mean? Are there people in your dog food? Is it Soylent Green? I'd like you to throw the, the dog food out a little faster, please. I am on a schedule. <laughs> I only have so many landfills that I can fill. It's so much time to do it. I like that this these ones have flies around them. I'm just gonna ignore it. That's not my job. My job is to throw things. Oh, oh, more, more gene research lab. Hi again. Lab experiment subjects. Yeah, you got it, Gary. Well, there's nothing I can do about it now. Why are your barrels so fucking soft? I don't mean that in a good way. You dumb soft barrels. Well, nothing I can do about it now. Fucking hell, goddamn. Oh no, I messed everything up. Shame. <laughs> Tempering with evidence. $8,000 fine. All right. Well, this has been uh Hello Pollution. And Glad Glider Store. I don't I genuinely can't even remember. 
this game has burned my brain. Um, a glider's journey. Let's, um, hopefully the next game I grab will be a bit longer so I can just have a single video of that and not have to clip them together. Unless you like these very short clipped together videos. Until then. Bye. I forgot to record an ending screen.